point. There's one right here. Okay. And one one of these females is better than the other for a uterus. One, it's not as clear. Probably not this one. Okay, let's take a look at this guy right here. So first thing with dogfish, you gotta find the claspers. Yeah. Now if you're dealing with a male or female, if you don't know if it's a male or female, you're pretty claspers. Done. Um, Here's, this is the ovary, this is the ovary, the ovary's there and there. Okay. Yeah, so right in here. The oviduct is this tube running right down. And realize the kidney is all underneath here. All this dark stuff you're seeing yeah. is, is the kidney. So if you follow this tube all the way down, here it's pretty clear. See how this one opens up? Oh, okay, I see. Into That's that. the uterus. Yeah, this is uterus here. This really must be a juvenile because it's the really small, and then one here. It's just this, uh, see how it yeah, widens bulging. right at the bottom? Yeah, so this is this widening right here is and, the uterus. Okay, and what is the arcnephric duct in the females? They're really difficult to see. Yeah, I, I can it. point to them. Uh, but they're real. I can tell you where they are. So if you look in the arcanectric duct, yeah. it should be medial from the oviduct. So if push this away, uh, it's probably that. No, let me see. There's a ligament here also. Uh, no, it's see that what you're looking at is. Yeah, this is the caudal ligament. See, this guy uh -huh. right here is this. Uh -huh. so the arcanephric duct is very difficult to see. Got these things stink. See this right there? Yeah. That's it. Okay. Would we get tested on that realistically? Uh, if I can't point to it that well, no. Okay. It's this guy right there. But now in the male, the arcanephric duct is much, much yeah. yeah, it's this squiggle coming yeah. all the way down here. Okay. Now remember in the, in the male, so this is kind of where the terminologies get a little screwy. Here the arcanephric duct, is, what it's doing is carrying urine okay. from the kidney out, while the uh, oviduct is carrying gametes down. Okay. Over here, the arcanephric duct is what's carrying the sperm. Okay. And the accessory urinary, urinary duct. duct, which I call, I think in the, What's it called on our sheet? It is called accessory arcanephric duct. Accessory arcanephric duct. duct. That's responsible for urine. For urine. urine. Yeah. Okay. So it's this guy right here. All right. Can you show me the testes on yeah. the? Yeah. It's this. These big guys right there. Okay, they're big. Okay. Yeah. I was looking for something these small. right here. Okay. And then on the other side. Uh, this right, right there. there. Okay. Where? Oh, right there. So paired on, uh, you're paired on both yeah. sides, yeah. and you can tell they have this kind of like suspend uh, the, their ligament that's holding them. So yeah, it's this guy, right? Okay. Right and then the sperm sac. Oh, I almost touched my head. Sperm sac all the way down here. Um, is this? Okay. Because you come down, squiggle, 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 then it becomes the spermatic vesicle, oh, seminal vesicle. Yeah. So squiggle, squiggle down. And Here it becomes seminal vesicle, and then you track this to right there bunch. is the sperm sac. Yeah, that uh, container right there. Okay. Thank you.